Okay, if you're unable to obtain any urine um, or if you don't have any of the milk crystals uh, to test for ketone bodies in the milk, you can actually obtain blood from these cattle and you just need a very small amount of blood to determine their ketone body levels. Um, if you're going to take a small amount of blood from these dairy cattle, a very appropriate place to do that is the, to use the tail vein, which is known as the coccygeal vein. So I'm going to demonstrate taking blood from the tail vein of this cow. So we're going to take her tail and we're going to lift it straight up and we're going to take a 4x4 four four to wipe clean the area that we're going to draw blood from. The area that we choose or the landmark is basically right running right down midline of our cattle's tail, the coccygeal groove. And this groove can be palpated digitally like this. But ultimately, the basic principle is always remember that the vein runs on midline. So that's the direction that we're going to try to aim for is right on midline. So we'll use a small syringe with a needle. We'll steady our hand onto the side of the cow's tail like, like this. And then we'll look for midline for this cow. And we'll actually insert the needle into the tail. Hopefully we're within the coccygeal vein or artery. And then we'll pull back and we'll obtain a blood sample from the coccygeal vein, it looks like. And then once we're finished, we'll actually put pressure with a clean part of your gauze onto the area that we drew blood from. And then we'll use the blood on a test um, to determine ketone body levels in this cow.